Ashley Escamilla. Um, I teach at Allen B. Shepherd Middle School, and I teach sixth grade reading. That is probably one of the biggest things um, that's happened to me is um, a godsend. Um, I work with a bunch of my teachers, my former teachers, and that was nerve-wracking in itself just to go into an environment where I used to be the student and now I'm a peer. So there was a lot of stress at the beginning, um, but they just love on me. Shepherd is a big family, and I'm thankful to be at that campus because we do everything together. We eat together, we work together, we um, help each other. I'm thankful and it means so much to me that my former teachers as well as teachers who mentored me and helped me become the teacher I am today thought that I deserved this honor. The fact that I went to Five Palms, Allen B. Shepherd, West Campus High School, that is huge. I think I always introduce myself at the beginning as I used to be here. I used to sit in your seat. And for a lot of my students, they can't believe that. You didn't come here. You didn't go to that school. Or um, when they find out that I did go to their school, and they'll ask, did you have this teacher? Or did you have um, so-and-so? And sometimes I did have that teacher. So they're in all that, you know, their teacher had um, or was a former student at one of their elementaries. So that, that in itself, I think, helps. And I always tell them, you know, there's more than, than just staying here and doing that. I try and get, give them an opportunity to see outside. You know, I've gone to school in Dallas. I went to China. I went to Ukraine. I went, and I came from this district. You know, there are possibilities to go see the world. They just have to have that in them. And I try and instill um, that want and desire in my students, especially teaching reading. It kind of opens the gate for that. I try and implement different countries and different people and different experiences and um, going to school away. I know for my family, having me leave within the state from San Antonio to Dallas was the, a huge thing. And with our Hispanic roots, you know, you want to keep family close and having my students see that, you know, there are possibilities for you to go further always helps them. And um, I know there are times where we're reading and we'll talk about dialect and reading, or uh, we'll talk about a certain country, and I'll bring in my experience into my lesson, and they have so many questions. They have, I mean, their own experiences, too. I've had students who said, you know what, I've, I've seen the Holocaust Museum. I've been there, too. I've, and I think for them, that's the gate. Like, that will lead them into a better future for themselves, just seeing that they, there is a possibility for them to do more than what we sometimes think. Five, ten years, um, because I'm finishing my master's to be a reading specialist, I hope to continue to help my district and become that reading specialist. Reading is a huge part in a child's success. I believe that if they can read, they can do math, they can do science, but I hope to eventually be a reading specialist and help my students become better readers so that they can read for themselves and learn for themselves and not need so much of the guidance but be able to guide themselves.